Teachers here in New Haven are calling on the city to prioritize education in this year's budget. Teachers from across the district coming together to make sure that their message is heard. Now, teachers here in the city are asking for an additional $12 million over what the mayor and the city are considering. Now, the city is proposing a $5 million increase over last year's amount, but teachers say that's not enough, arguing the budgets over the last several years have also been too low and schools are suffering. The needs of our students are growing more and more complex. We know there are English language learning needs. We know there are mental health needs. We know the facilities of our schools need investment. So as a result, we believe that funding must be delivered to make sure that solutions are in place. Teachers say as far as they're aware, no job cuts are on the line like we've seen in other districts like Hartford and Enfield. However, they say the city proposal would make class sizes grow larger. They also say the buildings need improvements, citing no soap dispensers in the bathrooms, teachers sharing classrooms and supplying classrooms themselves. Hundreds of school staff members wore stickers at work today that said fund our schools, hoping to make waves ahead of the Board of Alders meeting. That Board of Alders meeting is scheduled for Tuesday. You can stick with us on air online and on Fox 61. Plus, as we follow the details on that. In New Haven, Lindsay Kane, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.